Hey guys, it's Alex here, back with another Yulia commentary, and today we're going to be answering the age-old question of outdoor cage or indoor cage. I'm going to try and make this one pretty basic by just listing off the pros and cons. As you guys know, I personally just have an indoor cage and I've found it pretty suitable. But uh, there are a lot of uh, pros to having an outdoor cage. So uh, as you guys probably noticed, I have a giant indoor cage, and uh, I think there are some pretty basic pros to it. Um, I think it looks a lot nicer, personally, than an outdoor cage, and I feel like the, the way that you can kind of style your cage is a lot more, uh, open. And, uh, because, you know, in an outdoor cage, there's wind, there's, you know, weather, the elements, so you have a, you have to be a little more careful with the decor you put in your cage, but for an indoor cage, it's a, it's a little bit easier. Uh, there's also the fact that your iguana is a lot safer in an indoor cage just because they don't have to face the elements, they don't have to face wild animals and whatnot. Um, and uh, you don't have to worry about your iguana escaping into the wilderness, <laughs> which uh, Yulia finds a way to escape her cage like at least once a week, so it's pretty nice that she has an indoor cage that I know uh, she can't really go that far in. And uh, the cons for an indoor cage are pretty basic too. Um, first thing I think of is lighting. Uh, lighting can get pretty expensive, uh, since you have to switch out UVB bulbs every six or so months. Um, and those things are like $20 a pop. So, uh, it can get, like, kind of expensive. Not too expensive, but you know, you gotta buy a heating bulb too, and lay them out carefully. Buy some extension cords and probably timers. <laughs> it can add up, believe it or not. Um, but anyways, yeah, lighting is something that, that kind of sucks for indoor cages. Uh, I mean, if you go outside, you just got the sunlight, and uh, that's free, or at least, I think so. Um, and also, another con would be this cage takes up a ton of space. Like, look at this. This is like a quarter of the room, at least. With an outdoor cage, you're not going to have to worry about that kind of stuff. Um, now, moving on to outdoor cages. There are actually some pretty big pros to having an outdoor cage. Um, well, the first thing you need to check before you even look into getting an outdoor cage is, is it warm enough all year round for your iguana to stay outside? And uh, you've got to live in the right place, basically. So if you're living in Tennessee, uh, not gonna happen. You're gonna have to, <laughs> you're gonna have to either buy an indoor cage and an outdoor cage just for the summer, uh, or you're just gonna have to put it indoors. So. That's the first thing you have to check on, but after that, there are some actually pretty decent pros. Uh, like I was talking about, free lighting, uh, that's nice. Takes up way less space. You don't have to worry about sectioning off basically half a room for your lizard, which is, I mean, pretty nice. <laughs> I, I like the idea of not having to buy a separate room just for my iguana. And for the cons, it was basically just like I was saying before, you gotta worry about the weather, um, the 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 climate of uh, your region, you have to worry about that. Uh, wild animals, you have to worry about your iguana escaping. So there are quite a few cons, and uh, the fact that you have to live in the right place ultimately uh, did it in for me. I thought about getting an outdoor cage for the summer, but I just never got around to it, and now I'm going to college, which is a bummer. <laughs> so I can't really help her out anymore. I'm very. Very sad to say, Yulia, I'm never going to be able to get you that that outdoor condo I promised you all those years ago. But yeah. <laughs> Anyways, that's uh, that's pretty much the rundown. Uh, that's it for this video. Um, if you guys uh, have an outdoor cage or an indoor cage, tell me in the comments below. And tell me which one is objectively better, please. <laughs> and um, yeah, if you have a fight, please, uh, please let me know. I'll pin it. <laughs> Anyways, uh, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I will see you around.